Thanks for being here. A Greater Johnstown High School student is in trouble after school officials say a custodian found a loaded handgun inside a backpack belonging to the student. School principal said the gun was found in the cafeteria by a custodian overnight and no students were in any danger. Jacqueline Kovac talked to school officials and joins us with more on this developing story. Jackie? Jen, Marty, school officials aren't releasing information about the student who was arrested this morning by Johnstown police, but they did say that other Johnstown school students weren't in any danger because they believe the student had the gun and was in had the gun in response to events that were taking place outside the school. Now, just to recap, the officials say a custodian working overnight found a back found a handgun inside a backpack in the cafeteria when the backpack was getting placed in lost and found officials say the custodian noticed the bag was unzipped and the handgun was found inside loaded the school principal and assistant to the superintendent amy arquiro said the protocols were quickly put in place and it was determined that the bag belonged to the student who was arrested at his home this morning and this all took place before any students stepped inside the school the school was thoroughly checked before the school started this morning and it was determined the area was safe again officials say no students were in any harm's way it's very concerning to us that our students are feeling unsafe walking to and from school while they're in our community, um, dealing with issues that are beyond our school walls. Again, the student was arrested this morning by the Johnstown Police Department. He will be suspended from school and likely won't be returning to the high school this year. Officials say after all the incidents this morning, they realized rumors were flying around and misinformation was getting out. They want to assure parents that their children were never in any harm's way. But if you do have any questions for school officials, you can contact the center administration at their office on Broad Street. Reporting live, Jacqueline Kovac, 6 News.